Happy Valentine's Day, everyone. There's love and magic smoke in the air here at Sparkfun Electronics, and we've got some new products to talk about. First up, we've got a new book for the Raspberry Pi. Raspberry Pi Hacks is a really great book that shows you how to hack your Raspberry Pi. It has a lot of different examples and tips and tricks of things you can do around the house, and also how to use the Raspberry Pi in general. So if you're looking to do a little bit more through Raspberry Pi, check out Raspberry Pi Hacks. In addition to this book, in the next coming weeks, we're going to have some more tutorials on Raspberry Pi, so be sure to check back then for more tutorials and information on how to use your Pi. Next up, we've got a couple new connectors. These are BTC, or British Telecom connectors. These are the British equivalent to what we use over here in the United States, which is the RJ11, you know, just your traditional phone cable. Although we don't use these connectors here in the US, you can commonly find them used with vernier sensors. We use them on the Vernier Shield, which we released a couple weeks ago, to attach to their sensors. The Shield is a simple interface that allows you to connect the sensors into the Shield and then thusly use it with your Arduino. So now we have the connectors as well as the Shield. So if you have trouble finding the individual connectors, we've got both the A and the D, which is the left hand or the right hand. Lastly, we have the V-Key Voltage Keypad. It is a keypad with 12 individual buttons, which you solder yourself. And when all this is put together, you get a keypad that you have 12 individual unique buttons that you can press. Because each button has a unique resistance value, you can easily determine which button is being pressed by reading just the single analog value. We've got a little demo set up just to show a very simple analog read that is mapped to each one of the individual buttons. So when we press a button, we can see which button is pressed and the corresponding analog value for that button. Before we start this demo, I'd like to demonstrate the dangers of outsourcing. This demo is put together by Nick Poole, and this is the first time I'm really seeing it, and I really wish I had checked the work before, as you'll see. So if I press the one button, we can see a nice little message comes up. You pressed number one, and the raw ADC reading was 479. So that is the unique reading to number one. If we press number eight, you can see that it has a completely different value. And we have these lovely little Valentine's Day messages. For those of you wondering who Dave might be, here he is. This is Dave. He's made cameos in several of the new product post videos, so you might want to go back and check out some of the older videos and check out Dave in action. For those of you wanting more information about the V-Key, we do have a full tutorial that shows you how to get all the values out of there, the value of each one of the buttons, and a quick little assembly guide. So be sure to check that out if you're interested in the V-Key Voltage Keypad. These are all the lovely products we have for this Valentine's Day. We have the Raspberry Pi book, we've got the BTC British Telecom connectors, and of course the V-Key Voltage Keypad. We do have more new products available on the website, so go ahead and check that out at sparkfun.com, and we'll be back next week with even more new products.